your phone just come out. You know, you don't even That's how it goes. You can walk in, your ear just for power that feeling it for. It's a bad disease. So these guys are leper. They are lepers. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, there's a law here with Moses to say, anyone that is a leper, they shall be put away from the society. They will be in a far place alone there. Now, when they are healed, there was a priest. First of all, before you come to the city, you must go to the priest. And the priest must verify you to ensure that you are healed. And then do a ceremony. Take two pigeons or two beds, kill one, put in the water, and then take that water, the other one, put it in that water and let it free. And then they cleanse with that. So it was a, that's how it was. So now look at these dead lepers. And they they lifted up their voices and said, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. Hallelujah. Amen. So when you see healing is the mess of God. Amen. That's why I declare tonight this mess has come. Hallelujah. Amen. 14. And when he saw them, he said to them, Go show yourselves and to the priests. My question is this, are they healed? I said, are they healed? Amen. No, they are not. Yes, they still have it. But you can't go to the priest until you are healed. But Jesus says, go. No, I can't go. Make me go first. Then I'll go. Because if I go to that priest, I can be killed. Why am I coming to society with these levels? But this is how you get healed. Amen. Amen. Obedience to the command of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Huh? Amen. What if they say, they told us to go, but we are supposed to be healed? Isn't how many of us we are doing today? Amen. First, I need to feel good before I do this. Amen. Yes. It will be too late. Amen. You want to fail, you want to wait to feel good. Then, Lord, if I feel good, I'll do this. Yeah. God says, Go and do it. Hallelujah. <laughs> this guy, they have got all the reason to, to reject and say, We cannot go. Again, we cannot. Yes. Say, Lord, we cannot. Yes. Many of you, God has told you to do certain things. You said, I can't. Yes. That's God who said, Trust it. Yes. That's how I work. Do you see why many of us are not experiencing miracles? Because we want to first see. We have, we have obtained the pattern of the world to say, Seeing is believing. Yes. But you can't walk with God like that. Until I see money in my pocket, I can't go to the project. Uh -huh. If God told you, the, 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 the money is in the way, hallelujah. Amen. The healing is in the way, hallelujah. Amen. So he told these guys, go show yourself to the priest. They are not healed. They are full of lepros, but go. That's how you get healed. If you stay there, you remain like that. Ah! With God, you must dance that money has come when the landlord is calling you telephone. Hallelujah! Hey! Hallelujah! Amen. You must go acting like you are healed when your body is challenged at a higher level. Hallelujah! Amen. I'm telling you, that's how you get healed. God put it that way. I must first wait. It will be too late. Because even Josina on the road can do that. You know Josina? Is it Josina? On the road. Can also believe when they see something. That's why you see faith is not for children. Is for the mature, hallelujah. Amen. On Wednesday, she went last week. 
When I, I wake up in the morning, I was just sleeping. I didn't want to do it. When I came, second waking up, I couldn't. When I pay like this, like they strike with the knife. That's what's the case. <laughs> but I knew this, this, this is not his purpose. If I go, I die. And I knew in my heart that if you stay in that bed, you remain there. I jumped out. Bah! It's many fun. I jumped out to wear my gym, wear my t shirt, wear my sneakers, and walk to Christ. Don't do that. That's how you get into I went to place that I could sense the pain just begin to reduce. Again, I came home, but again, I went to Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. And you know what? I said I must bend because there I was not bending. I bent on the road. I felt like I said, I'm so much bend. I touched. After two hours, everything came right. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm glad to show you because the devil is always going to attack you. But you need to respond like you already got it. You're not trying to get it, you have it. Hallelujah. Amen. He's trying to take it out from you, but you already have it because God has made to you. So those few symptoms are trying to tell you you don't have it. But you must insist you have it. Hallelujah. Amen. You have it. I say you have it. Amen. I say you have it. Amen. I say you have it. Amen. God has inspired me to say this today because this is very important. Look at this. Go show yourself to the priest. And it came to pass that as they went, as they what? As they what? They were cleansed. Not when they stood there. So God can tell you are healed. But you look like you're about to die. <laughs> Are you seeing these things? Yes. That's how you get results with God. If God says, I'm going to give you one million, then in your pocket, not even one rand, you must act like you're one million. Hallelujah. Amen. Because God has spoken. Amen. When God has said, all your children will save the Lord, yes. and then you see all your children become now waste must begin to dance. They are going to serve the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm not sure how you get there. But now you understand. You, these children, you don't listen. You, 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 you are. You are just an idiot. You, now you are not making it impossible for God to wait. Hallelujah. Amen. Because the devil will always contradict the word of God. Hallelujah. Amen. You try to prove it wrong, but when you stand on the word, you see result. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Satan always challenges the word. But those who stand on the word, they always come out stronger. Hallelujah. Amen. And powerful in the name of Jesus. Amen. Stand on the word of God and God has spoken to you. As they went. Once again, as they went. Amen. As they went doing what? Acting like they were healed. Amen. Talking, they are healed. Amen. Behaving, they are healed. Amen. Dancing, they are healed. Hallelujah. Amen. As they went. As they what? Yes. What if they stayed there? No. And God And you would have said, the word of God doesn't want you to go there. As the men are saying. Yes. When I was crushing my, my, my shoes, the Lord dropped in my heart. I want to pray for this house that just got done. But I was just brushing my teeth. Oh, sorry, my shoes. Just like want to speak to you. The Lord showed me that their life is still changed. I was crushing my shoes. Just come up. And the children of this, I was at his way. Just come up to me. As if a son. Just dropped in my spirit. I told my mother to change this. Father, I'm doing what you showed me right now in the name of Jesus when I was shining my shoes you said you are changing their lives in the name of Jesus I speak this word that your life may change 
in the name of Jesus Christ. Let the power of the Lord shift you and change you. In the name of Jesus. Father, everyone will see a miracle because you already have it for them. I bless them, Lord. In Jesus' name. Lift your voice and begin to thank God. Just begin to thank Him in the name of Jesus. You can have a seat and thank God. Praise the Lord. Just begin to thank Him. Lift your voice and thank Him. So they brag it to Just begin to thank Him. Appreciate God. Begin to magnify Him. Begin to magnify Him. In the name of Jesus. You can have a seat. Begin to magnify God. Begin to magnify God. Begin to magnify So the Begin to magnify the Lord. Magnify the Lord. So the Magnify God. Magnify God. Magnify God. I appreciate you. Magnify him. Give him praise. He's worthy of all the praise. Magnify him. Lift up your voice. Magnify him. Magnify our God. So Kataria la Mandela. Magnify him. Then Pro Kataria. Magnify him. Then the Pro Yatiala. Go ahead and magnify the Lord. I appreciate you. Where do you the praise? I appreciate you. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. I want us to pray in tongues for two minutes. Just want to pray in tongues and allow the praises of God. Just to go with it now. In this place, just lift your voice. Uh, uh, just begin to pray the spirit. In the name of Jesus, begin to pray the spirit. Lift your voice and pray tongues. Get out of my Just lift your voice. Lift your voice and pray the spirit. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Lift your voice and pray tongues. Lift your voice. Lift your voice, lift your voice. 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 Just pray to us. In Jesus' name. Just stay here as I am. Just take me as I am, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus Christ, yes, you died for me, just take me as I am. Yesterday, the Hebrews, that's it, that's the name that came, that's the husband, Like a day, I had one to work. I was performance. The doctors didn't trust me. She came and I told her, Come for it. She came, she sat right there. Where my boss is sitting. When I was about to begin to open the word of God, I saw an angel just pull something. And instantly, that had been left just by the Hallelujah. And I sense the same angel who came yesterday has come to me. Hallelujah. So watch out because God will be touching right now in the name of Jesus. So I was walking your presence the same one is moving. Hallelujah. That's the little voice again. Praise him in the spirit. He's already moving. He's touching you. So class the same one is touching you. Londo so glotesh, Metro so glotesh, Clate clamando lo no dia le tata, Mabra de le tele brasa la dia la metalaba, Mende pre de le cose clata la mandele presia le galavana gosia, Maso cotondo mele de le bria sasane mele meria cloche. Lift your voice, lift your voice, lift your voice, lift your voice, Tete te la prosisia, Mende le pre de le cosindia, Mende le cose de le meriala. In Jesus' name, hallelujah. You see what is happening? You see, Brother Clement, he brought his camera and his stand. He said, to shoot from a 
It's a picture of where we are going. These things are coming already. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. God bless you. Hallelujah. I say, God bless you. Hallelujah. We just going to pray a lot. Just more. Okay, but I just says that God and Muslim. Just again, pray in the spirit. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Restoration is coming. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Restoration is coming. Esubaria, Mendeberio, Opraderia, Zekla Nondo, Ekla Mande, Shalebra Dos. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We bless you. We bless you, Lord. We bless you. Just go down as you are holding there. Oh, thank you, Lord. We bless you, Lord. Almighty God, we bow before your Lord. We bless your name, yeah. Almighty God, we bow before your Lord. We bless your name, Almighty God. Almighty
thank you, Lord. We receive your presence, Lord. We receive your presence, Lord. We receive your presence, Lord. Hallelujah. We receive your presence, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for touching us this morning. We receive your presence, Father. In the name of Jesus. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. As hallelujah. Amen. You know, if you don't know to bring the presence of God, that music, you're not yet developed. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The, the presence of God must be brought down Amen. without any organ. Hallelujah. Amen. So organ just was given us, us to go ahead. But the presence of God, because in that room when you're alone, you must sing to God. Hallelujah. Amen. And worship Him. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah.
Father, we thank you. We receive your presence, Lord. Thank you for your presence. In the name of Jesus. Oh, thank you, Lord. Who knew that Esther one day could become a princess? Born from a poor background. And on top of that, her parents died. She was an orphan. Raised by an uncle, Mordecai. And the uncle was a gatekeeper at the door. But God had a plan. Hallelujah. Amen. The same way God has a plan for you. Amen. Nothing can kill you. Hallelujah. Amen. I declare, I say, nothing can kill you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Woo! Oh, Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Again, God has a plan for me. God has a plan for me. How many believe God has a plan for them? Amen. He has a plan for your life. Amen. That's what I declare. Nothing can kill you. Hallelujah. Amen. Or as nothing can destroy you. Amen. You are going to live your purpose. Amen. You are going to fulfill your purpose. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Disease shall be far away from your territory. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. As a far away from your territory. Amen. In the name Ah, I rebuke the source of sickness in your family. Amen. I rebuke the source of disease in your family. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. God will fight for you. Amen. I say God will fight for you. Amen. I say God will fight for you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh, God is going to fight for us. <laughs> Amen. Hey. Don't fight for yourself. You fight for me. Amen. Amen. I feel like creating a song here. He fights a battle for me. Oh, yes, he does. And I know even this one is going to fight for me. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. And tomorrow when it comes, the Lord will fight for me. Amen. Next week when it comes, my father is there to fight for me. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Shame on you, devil. The only person in my shame is the devil. Shame on you, devil. Amen. Because my God is fighting for me. Hallelujah. Amen. Woo! Amen. Woo! Hallelujah! Amen. Huh? Amen. This is the day I tell people in the evening school. I say, don't say shame. This thing of shame is in South Africa a lot. I'm in a victim. We are raised by a victim. You hear? Oh, did, did they come? Oh, shame. And people, they even say it just. They, no, it's bless. It's like they're all blessed. Why, why only shame? Because the devil wants to have cast away in your mouth. I'm in a way, it's a South Africans. I'm in a way. Even Zimbabweans are falling into it now. Even, even Zambians are also into it. So, what's the problem? It's a, it's, it's a creative force. You hear, oh, shame. And, oh, shame. And their, their ignorance, ignorance, and their prophesy ignorance. Yes. Not from today. That's what you're talking to me. Watch out. Most of the session, I say, hey, 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 hey. Please. <laughs> the devil doesn't want you to have that word, bless. Amen. In your mouth. He just wants to say, share. Mm -hmm. huh? Or, oh, them, damn it. <laughs> this damn phone. What can you say this blessed phone? Hallelujah. Amen. You say this phone you are going to save me until I get a new one. Hallelujah. Amen. Why not that word on? If your hand is me, you probably say, My hand I bless you. Hallelujah. Amen. My hand you are going to save me. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. And as long as I live, you, you must save me. Hallelujah. Amen. That's how I do I talk. <laughs> this life of the spirit works. Amen. But the issues you've been taught in the past, wrong doctrines, 
that you have to say what you feel. No, no. In the school of faith, you don't talk what you feel. Uh -huh. Amen. Because if you talk what you feel, it will increase. I feel, you can say I'm challenged. I have a challenge of faith. Don't say, I feel, I have it. In the school of faith, it's not a man. The Bible says in Romans 4, 17, going down, it says this. God calls those things that are not. Are you in that word? He calls those things that are not as though they were. As though they were. And by doing that, he quickens the dead. So, how does quickening come? You have to say, no, 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 no. You can feel your body is in pain. You say, in the name of Jesus, I call my body healed. You, you say, you are calling it to be so. Amen. That's why the Bible says, faith calls what is not there as though, as though it is there. <laughs> so, don't say, what's the name of your dog? I'm a rod. Meroda, that's another dog. Okay, so if, uh, if Meroda is not there, and then maybe it's going to play the neighborhood, maybe he jumped by the oil, you know. And then you prepare food and say, Meroda! You say, then you say, ah, where is Meroda? Here yeah, is food. No, call him. When he knows your voice, will come. You go, Meroda! Meroda! Then you say, you see him coming. Where the wagon is, he's there. He's coming to me now. What you call it? Same way. When you feel pain, call healing. Hallelujah. Amen. You don't say what you feel. If your knee is pain, let's say, my knee is pain. No, you say, in the name of Jesus, my knee, I call you be healed. Then you say, pain, I talk to you. Go in the name of what? Jesus. Jesus. And expect that. That's how you get healing. Amen. That's how you get healing. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So talk to the part that you are being. If it's the whole body, say, my whole body, I command you, be normal. Amen. Wake right. Hallelujah. Amen. I command healing my body in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. As you do that, then the power of God will weaken you. Hallelujah. Amen. The power of God is inside of you, but you must activate it through ways. Hallelujah. Amen. But does that, I feel it's so painful. I know it's painful, but call what you want to feel. That's why it says, calling those things that are not, that are not, as though, as though, as though, as though, call your children the serving God, not, I'm tired of this, children, my mother. This is, I'm tired, I'm just tired. That's what faith calls one is not there, to be there, to be there, to be, you call it. My children, they are saving God. Even when they have just done silly stuff, say, my children, they are saving God. Hallelujah. Amen. Me and my house, we are saving God. Hallelujah. Amen. That's how faith works, and that's how God works. Hallelujah. Amen. I think that is the person. We need to work on these things. Amen. I'm not denying the pain. but, I, but, but I, 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 I'm not saying there's no pain. I'm denying it's right on my body. Amen. I'm denying it's right on my hand. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm denying that. I'm saying, no, no, no. No, I call you be well. I'm not denying that it's, it's, it's not there. Because faith does not deny that it's not there. It calls what is not there to be there. Amen. I said to be there. Amen. If you don't have money, call money to come. Amen. Are you getting this? Amen. I think God is embracing my spirit. So that we get these things right. But I feel, I know you feel, but God told you, call it what is not there to be there. Amen. And then, if you call it, then go act like it's there, and then to be there. Amen. So what if the, those lepers, they just say, Jesus, until we are healed, we are not going. You, you don't tell a blind man, go wash inside your home. The man is blind, he can't see. John 9, Jesus says, he applied the mud and the spatter. You know, you know, it's not hygiene to apply someone this part of it. Ah, poof. That's what Jesus did. He said, poof. And even, let me be the soul. And applied is that. That's not sanity. But you see, 
Sight is not a problem. You can't deny results. Hallelujah. Amen. I think prophet is lost. I went somewhere and then the Lord showed me that. Tell this mama to take soap. Soap, just this soap for bathroom. And melt it. So she, she, she thought I would tell her to drink it. I said, no, I'm not going to drink it. They melt it. And she melted it. Because that's what I saw a enemy that was fighting. I did. To overpower her. And the Lord said, also tell her to melt soap. She took soap to the power of darkness. And did magic with soap. And they melted it to bind that affair. The favor can go into her. Yes. So I also told her, you know this story. I also told her, you know, you also, God showed me, take soap, melt it. So we said, we could tell you silly stuff, but they obeyed them. <laughs> and so she melted the soap, and I told her, go and flush it. She went, she go and throw all the liquid that's melted and flush. That's it. And she won the case. Hallelujah. Amen. She won the case. Amen. But if there was no prophet to see that, that you would have won the case. Not, not. Case came in so don't don't argue with me. When I tell you something, don't just argue. Just I said doesn't make sense. If I say go and dance, <laughs> one hour, just go and dance. You say, I will sweat, no problem, just sweat. You know? At that time, God is showing us we are going to dance one hour. Hallelujah. Amen. So Mrs. Constant, your life is going to change this year, Lord. So very soon you see them coming to pass. Write some record of the gates when it says this. Because I, it dropped when I was shining my shoe. Right, right it today. Uh, you know I'm probably is going to do things. <laughs> he said, when when Pastor was shining the shoe, <laughs> they put the red there. He dropped. I saw the place. You see, me, I know I walk with all as people. Me, even when I'm bathing, I'm focusing. But something they drop. I'm expecting something to drop. When I'm coming, the same I'm expecting maybe something to drop. I'm always expecting something to drop for you. That's how I move, always. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I'm blessed. Amen. Are you blessed? Amen. Are you going to call yourself blessed? Amen. I want to say I'm blessed. Amen. Second, I'm blessed. Amen. Second, I'm blessed. Amen. Don't walk with your face down. Walk with your face up. Amen. Amen. There are men like us who can't pull us, they can't put us down. It's impossible. Even when I when, when I'm when I'm just low. I will just put myself up there. Amen. Amen. I will sing unto the Lord. I will praise unto the Lord. Amen. I will worship the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. I will magnify the Lord. Amen. Just look through the camera, please. Amen. You see, all these things are prophecies that our cameras are coming. Amen. And God will bless them. Hallelujah. Amen. As they are doing this work of the Lord. Amen. Amen. I'm going to be blessed. Amen. Now listen. I want to begin to pray about it. I want people in March that can soar toward the drum. Drum, drum seat. Are you getting a drum? So looking for me. And I want people that can give toward the drum. Whatever she, the Lord will put in her heart to put together. You can, you can give 1,500 by, by the end of March. You want to give to the Lord. You want to buy a drum. Because I sense God in the Bible, sense I'm not going to play. So when our pastor touched the head, you do do it. Now you can watch it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> so begin to plan whatever you can give, where you are. If you are at 500, give 100. If you are at 300, give 300. If you are at 200, give 200. If you are at 3,000, give 300. Wherever you are, plan by the end of March. So if you, are, if you know you are going to give after service, I want you to see me, we registered, we have the name, so that we see. We want to have uh, a drum set. I'm going to bless. Amen. We bless. Amen. Okay, let's welcome Dickon as he bless us and give. Let's have a hand for him. Amen. Amen.